I don't know. So uh, we will find out. I think um, we need a couple of races to see how the wrecks pan out and how the cars will be, how they will be to drive and how they will be to race. Um, well, it won't be the first time. We always had ground effect, um, a large contribution to the downforce we, we have in the cars, but obviously now it's the biggest contribution, so it will be more than previous years. Um, so yeah, looking forward to it. I think the cars should be a little bit different to drive, um, but until <laughs> we start the season, we don't know how different. Um, well, we obviously the, the main downforce will come from the floor. So uh, I think, uh, you know, the way you set up the car will be different and probably also the way you have to drive the car will be different. But how different we will have to, as I said, find out. I don't know. I think uh, we need to be a little bit more patient. Obviously, the idea is to improve racing, but um, we will see. Uh, maybe the first race is not the best indicator, but after a couple of races, I think very quickly we will know. Um, well, we started, I think, as one of the first teams to prepare for this season. So hopefully we start off well and then, um, you know, it will very much depend on how strong the car will be at the beginning of the year, where we are relative to others and how spread out or not the field will be. So all these answers I think we'll get uh, very shortly. Sorry. Normally when the rules are new, the field is a bit more spread out and the longer you stick to the same amount of rules, same rules, then uh, uh, the field comes closer together. It should be that, you know, with these set of rules, everybody starts closer to each other and then comes even more together. But again, we don't know. It all depends where the others are. I think uh, we've done our homework and uh, we've done what we could. And now uh, we will see, you know, how our car looks in comparison to the others and then especially how it feels on track. For sure, it helps. I know the people, you know, the people around me. So, um, yeah, I think that's, you know, obviously a, a, an advantage compared to last year. Um, the car will be new, so there will be, again, plenty of new things. But uh, this time we can tackle it together. Well, last year we had a disappointing year. So, obviously, we expect a big step up. Um, so, uh, you know, I, I, I'm, you don't know what to expect from all the new regulations, the new cars, etc. But uh, I think we, we're really aiming to make a big improvement and to fight for front positions. Yeah, it's been pretty, you know, pretty easy. So, uh, you know, we get along and we seem to push the, the team together. So, um, yeah, it's good to have continuity as well and just uh, keep progressing. Sure, I mean, uh, it's useful to hear that, uh, you know, my feedback is welcome. Um, I'm always trying to give as much feedback as I can wherever I can and, um, yeah, fit into the team and together obviously try to, to make the difference. Yeah, I think a new track is always exciting, so uh, we will see how it feels. But, um, yeah, I think generally looking forward to a new, new venue and Miami should be quite cool. Well, you look at the track beforehand, you obviously gather as much info as you can um, prior to the event. Uh, we do, you know, quite a bit of prep work in the sim usually. So, but then at some point, that's about it. You need to get on track and, and really get to experience it to get the real flow. Yeah, I'm looking forward to work with Mike again. I think, uh, you know, very good memories from the past and uh, he will be, a, a, you know, a, a, a huge contributor and strengthening the team. So looking forward to see him start. Absolutely. I think the team is growing uh, day by day. Uh, there's more people joining and the project just seems to get bigger and bigger, which is very exciting. So um, plenty of steps ahead of us still to take um, in order to, you know, get to the top. But um, yeah, the commitment surely is very high. Um, well, the cars were very different, um, so you don't take anything from that. Um, but uh, surely all the work with the team, working with the engineers, understanding the, the language, the technical language, um, the, you know, all the procedures. I think there's lots of stuff that we, we do carry over and a lot of the work that will be very similar um, just to a different, you know, working with different tools, meaning a different car. For sure, tyres will be new, um, so in, in addition to the cars, I think uh, it's a new, very, very new package. Cars will be heavier as well. So there's lots of uh, changes, individual changes, but they all come together as one big change. 
Yeah, I mean, uh, I have, you know, obviously we've had uh, plenty of prep in the sim, but uh, I haven't yet had the experience on track, so uh, we need to be a bit more patient, but uh, generally looking forward, I think, you know, it also depends how competitive the car is. It's more fun when it's fast <laughs> compared to the others, so yeah, we'll see. Well, it's getting more and more important to have, uh, you know, reliable sim data, not just uh, sim without the driver but also the using the driver sim to prepare the the events and uh, you know going through various scenarios prior to the weekend during the weekend to help well it's arti drs is artificial so ideally you don't need it um, but uh, you know it has helped in the last years to create some overtaking so we will see um, yeah i think you can always play with how long the drs zones are and how many they are but ideally you don't need them at all Well, good prep in the winter, obviously, and then once the season starts, there's not that much time, but you just try to stay in the rhythms, try and stay healthy, most of all, and uh, yeah, go race by race. So, um, you know, it will be key to stay healthy uh, throughout the entire season. Very different, very different driving style on snow and ice, but a lot of fun. Obviously, you go a lot more sideways than uh, I'm used to, but um, yeah, it was good fun meeting the other guys as well. So it's generally a very nice event.